Hard to get the jump line we're talking right now with state champion Mitchell Nelson in the 110 hurdles. Mitchell, his second Turner, state championship of the day as he shared with his teammates the shuttle hurdle earlier Randy today. Crutchy, he had kind of a quick Steve turnaround Rogers. after that state title in the shuttle hurdle. How did you get yourself re-mentally focused uh, for this race here? Yeah, it was kind of tough after the eight. shuttle. You know, the media and guys were Wagner, haggling, haggling us a little bit. So. You know, I've been standing up for a long time, didn't get my legs much rest. So, Nolan and I went over there and just sat down for a while. We didn't even stretch and move around like we normally would between the shuttle and highs because we'd been standing and talking for so long. And we, just, you know, we wanted to get a little rejuvenation probably. And I ate a granola bar or peanut butter sandwich. I can't remember which one I ate, but <laughs> just get, you know, get a little, maybe a little sugar, a little food in you, get you some more energy there. And you know, I. I think I'm the only guy. Once we get over there in the in the shoot, ready to about ready to get in the box, I'm sitting down over there, you know, because my legs are a little wobbly. And so I just I just sat down on the track back there. I think I was the only one, maybe. And yesterday in the morning, hurdles, I just completely laid down and sprawled out. I was just hoping nobody stepped on me with their spikes. So, you know, I just I try to get as much rest as possible. I think before the race, so I can. You know, yeah, you want to be a little warmed up, but I think the rest of your completely rejuvenated is probably the my most important thing I need over there. So, yeah, I did it with Nolan and I just went and sat down and just, you know, I was just getting mentally prepared, just thinking about it, visualizing a little bit maybe, and went over to the start line. Got it back. I know I talked to you quite a bit this year during the season. I could tell that shuttle state championship really was something you guys thought about. Had you thought much about this individual one in the 110s before today? Yeah, not, so, not until yesterday, I don't think, because. Uh, was uh, the Whiting, he was in lane four next to me there in the finals. He posted 14.5 for his fastest time, so I knew I wasn't probably going to be within two tenths of that. So if he was going to do that, then I was just going to be happy with silver. But in the prelims, he didn't even crack 15. He only ran a 15.08. So that made me a little more confident in. I think definitely wanting to go for the gold then instead of just you know, being, being okay with silver. I definitely wanted to go for it once I saw his prelim time. You looked really sharp coming out of the blocks. Did you feel like you got off to as good a start as it she looked. Yeah, yeah, definitely. That was probably my best start ever, I think, on the 110 eyes anyway. My my feet just felt like they were in a perfect spot on the on the blocks, and I felt like I got out of the gun really well, and I was first one in the first hurdle, I think, and then I was just laying down my feet faster than I ever had before. I think that was definitely my best race ever. Uh, over the first five, anyway, and then I got I got a little sloppy over the last half. You know, it's you can't ask for perfection all the way through, but I felt pretty close to perfect on the first five, anyway. So then I was I was sloppy over the last five, but you know, it was just enough. We were about even over the last hurdle. I just edged just just enough to the, to the finish line there. How did you get him at the finish line? Because it looked really close. Yeah, yeah, we were about neck and neck over the last hurdle. I might have had just a quarter step ahead of him. And, you know, I just, just pushed through that line. You don't stop and look at the clock or anything, you just, you gotta go until you get that line, it'll pop up, you'll find out your time later, you just, you gotta get to it first. How you gonna celebrate two state titles today? Uh, celebrate a little bit after the four by one, you know, we want, we're thinking we might be able to go for a silver or, or a third place there, so, probably not too much celebrating yet, but yeah, definitely very happy, you know. To win this award. Yeah, I don't know how I'm going to do it, but it'll be nice. Celebrating graduation, a couple state championships at the same time, it'll be good. I'll let you go get yourself ready for that four by one. Best of luck, we'll talk to you afterwards. Thanks. Congratulations.